talk about the accusations being dropped, but your reputation. Yes, it's your been, it's been today taunts. today is not what it was in spring of 96. Oh, not at all. And, and that's the most frustrating thing about it, too, is because now people perceive me to someone totally different. Than, right. And that, that's sad because that's not me. And I, But I'm not the type of person that I'm going to put my hands on, on anyone or disrespect anyone of any kind of nature. Uh, I wasn't raised that way. My grandmother raised me, and I respect people, um, males, females, you name it. Doesn't it seem like yesterday, that Saturday night, when you and Chris, we were all in that locker room, and it was like euphoria. You guys had just, you had signed, and he had been traded. He's gone. What is your feeling about Chris leaving the Wizards, knowing that it didn't work out the way everybody had dreamed? Well, you know what? The only two people that believed it could have worked was Chris and I. And that's what made it so special. And it's sad to see now that, you know, with all we've been through and what we've been on, on and off the court together, that you lose a family member. And, uh, and like I said earlier, I wish him the best in Sacramento, but you, know, you never know what the future will hold. Uh, we never know. We might be playing together again some other day. But we can look back on this um, and say we've learned a lot. Why doesn't Juwan now step up and say, folks, we're never going down the road. We've gone down before of, of all the problems. We're going to concentrate on winning basketball games. Well, I mean, I can't go out and just try to, like, paint a picture and tell every, well, everyone Michael what they Jordan want to hear. Michael Jordan does it. He runs the Bulls. Michael Jordan, at the time when he was 25 years old, it took, you got the walk before you run. And I'm not trying to make an You've excuse for myself. You've already fallen. I'm not trying to make an excuse for myself. And, you know, I'm not trying to look for sympathy or anything like that. You know, I'm a man enough to stand up and say I made a mistake. Right. I made a mistake. And yes, indeed, I used poor judgment that night. And I apologize for it. You know that your name's being talked about in trade. Yes. For I, David Robinson or else to, for Penny Hardaway. Yes. What do you want? Do you want to stay here or do you want to say, let me go away and start all over? No, I don't want, I'm not going to run. You know, I don't think that's the correct way of doing things. You know, I want, I would love to stay here and I want to stay here. Yes, I do. Uh, because I feel, you know, this fan's been wait the, the fans here in this organization have been waiting for a winning franchise for a long time. And Wes uh, Unsell and Elvin Hayes and guys like that who I respect so much uh, and, and who I look as as my leaders, as my role models, are those who who brought the franchise and winning to the Washington Bullets. That's what I want to help bring to the Washington Wizards franchise.